Friends, I'm sure you must have faced situations where you must be expecting guests within 10 minutes and you don't have anything to serve to them other than your uh, tea, coffee and biscuits. Uh, so here is a quick snack which you can make within 10 minutes uh, using some basic ingredients which is uh, always available at home. It is called the uh, chivra which is made with uh, flattened or beaten rice which we call it as poha and I'll just show you now how to make it within uh, say less than 5 minutes. Actually the basic ingredient is the poha which is a uh, flattened rice and uh, peanuts with the uh, usual seasoning ingredients like uh, mustard and chilies and curry leaves. So I'll just show how to make. A little of oil is required. I take little oil, maybe two spoons. Because it's made in microwave, you don't need much oil. The traditional one is usually fried. The poha is fried in oil. So this takes hardly two, three spoons of oil. So first I add the mustard seeds. A teaspoon of mustard. I have here chopped green chilies. That is up to you. You can add one or two chilies, finely chopped, few curry leaves. You can chop them or put them as it is. They'll be roasted in the oil. So once you have put this, I also have your uh, sliced dry coconut pieces. This is not a must. I like it, so I'm adding it. And usually the packed uh, uh, chura packets they come out come with this. So I'm just putting a few of them at this stage itself. Stir it well. I'm going to keep it for a minute in the microwave. This for one minute in full power. Yeah, just uh, the one minute is getting over. I'll just uh, remove it. Now I add, I've got here uh, 50 grams of, uh, actually it's quarter cup of peanuts. You can put as much as you want, less or more, as per your taste. I've got this fried gram dal. This is optional, this is not compulsory. But I'm just using all the ingredients today. Stir it well. And then a pinch of turmeric powder, haldi. Again, I'm going to keep this for a minute. After totally after two minutes, the peanuts and the dal, everything is uh, fried well, you stir it well. Now you can put this beaten rice. This is a paper thin poha. You get uh, different varieties of poha. This is a paper thin variety which is mainly used for chivda. So I've got four cups of these. Actually it is uh, just 150 grams. Stir it well. You can see that I have not used the oil after the first time. The same thing if you do it the traditional way, you will be using a lot of oil. So this is a very healthy portion. I've got here salt. So. I've got salt here. I'm stirring it. I'm going to keep it for two minutes. Now this poha has to get roasted a bit. Two minutes full power. In two full minutes are over, that is totally one plus one plus two, four minutes. Within four minutes, the chuda is almost ready. Almost because I'm going to add the secret ingredient which gives the flavor to this chuda. That is a pinch of citric acid. Nimbuka full they call it. This is citric acid, one or two pinches. As you like the 
tangy sour taste and sugar sugar also enhances the taste Keep it for uh, maybe a minute. A half minute also is enough. And allow it to stand. The chuda is ready. Just allow it to stand. And you can start eating it, serving it like this. You can see that everything is been roasted very well. Instead of peanuts or along with peanuts, you can even add almonds, cashew, uh, raisins, black currants. It becomes a more exotic snack. You see, in 5 minutes, our chuda is ready.